Well, today we did a prostate biopsy. And what was unique about this prostate biopsy is that for the first time, at least in the San Diego region, we're using a new technology that takes MRI and it merges it with the kind of pictures that we normally do when we do a prostate biopsy, which is ultrasound. But ultrasound is imperfect and it doesn't allow us in a very sophisticated way to see growths in the prostate that are suspicious for cancer. We took the most sophisticated technology available, an MRI, and merging that with the ultrasound machine when we do the biopsies so that I'm able to do a more sophisticated biopsy that uses the MRI images. We just had a patient, a perfect example, a gentleman who has been a patient of mine for several years, he's in his 70s, and he had a rising PSA. The numbers after a few years began to rise a little bit, and Dr. Parsons thought something might be up. He wasn't sure. He had several prostate biopsies done in the standard fashion using the ultrasound machine, and we never detected a cancer, and yet his PSA blood level kept going up, which was very concerning and, and anxiety-provoking for him. And then the MRI technology became available to us. And I happened to be in his office, and he looked at me and he said, you know, I think you would be a good candidate for this uh, procedure. I thought about it for a minute, and I said, yes, you know, that I would do it. We did the MRI-guided prostate biopsy here at Moore's, and in fact, we diagnosed a fairly aggressive prostate cancer. It turns out that um, there was a, at the very earliest stages of prostate cancer, which was the reason why my PSA count apparently was going up. And he, while of course troubled by the diagnosis itself, is very reassured that we were able to detect this cancer at a time where it is completely curable. And we were only able to do that because of the MRI. He found it at an early stage so that uh, uh, treatment can be more effective. Through the MRI, they can see not only the prostate, but the organs around the prostate so that it can very accurately detect where that prostate spot might be. What the MRI enables us to do is to put the needle exactly where we think the cancer is. And that greatly enhances the process, not only for cancer detection, but it enhances the patient experience. This is not the most pleasant procedure to go through. Biopsies to detect cancer never are. And if we can do anything to make that patient experience better, then I think it's a substantial improvement in the entire care of the cancer patient. This is the wave of the future. And I see this new technology as saving uh, thousands of lives. And uh, I commend Dr. Parson for taking the lead in San Diego in this area.